Welcome to the part 16. Today we are going to organize the folder with our parts. So make a new folder and call it uh, teapot for example. I'm gonna call it teapot toots. So I'm gonna put these two parts in. And let's make a few copies of this part. And let's delete. No, we don't have to. Let's rename it and call it Shen. I'm sorry, Shen. Shen Hover. And this is gonna be pasted a few times. So one of these is gonna be body right. And one is going to be body left. Next one is cable plus shitter. This one is going to be lead. Light glass. Small brackets and let me check body body cable handle lid light small okay so we got our parts and this is gonna stay as it is as a copy so let's first start edit bodies so where the folder is Okay, open the body left or right. I'm gonna open the left one first. <coughs> so it's finished, and only one thing is left, and this thing is fillet. So fillet by 2.5. This edge. I'm gonna put 3.5. Okay, and you don't have to do it for this edge. So select front plane and go to surfaces, cut with surface, and this should be direction of the cut. Okay. So let's see what we got. Is everything okay? It's fine to me. You can add some fillers if you want. I don't. I don't want to make it too complicated because it already is a lot complicated. So body right. And fillet by 3.5, I think I did, or 3.0. We can uh, check that later in assembly in some of the next videos. Videos, however. So, front plane again cut with surface, and this time it's opposite direction, like this. So it's done, let me go to the next part, it's a uh, handle cover, just, ok let's delete all bodies except this one, so insert features, delete body, this one and what, uh, ok so this should be this sh this should stay here. This shouldn't stay, and I can't see is that everything. Okay. 
so this is the only what should left the only body that should stay in this part save it and next thing is glass light glass Uh -huh. So we have to delete some features. Body delete one. Uh, let me see. Body. Okay, let's delete uh, from here to the end. Delete yes to all. And again, what's left? Delete and again what's left delete so now body delete 2 let's see what we have there okay so let's delete everything till here delete yes to all again until it's all deleted and again <coughs> and again come on <laughs> I'm gonna do it one by one Okay, body delete edit f uh, f f f f feature. So boss boss fillet. Okay, we are going to. Uh, huh, delete fillet. Is uh, okay. We delete everything. Okay, so delete everything except this glass and also the heater I think that's it so we got our glass okay and let's try to do small uh, how it's called shell one millimeter uh, uh, show preview and I'm gonna select this face looks like it's working so I think this is gonna work better for the for lights in the rendering and the light is finished next part is the small bracket bracket <coughs> okay open this part hmm I missed some detail detail uh -huh. in the last video I think I did it Let's see what teapot size. There should be something. Wow. No way I forgot to do. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a small bracket in the next part. Never mind. I'm gonna delete this one right now. And let's go to the lead we have a lot of work on this part so deleting everything like this again so what do we have here See? 
so let's again delete all features to here I'm gonna try deleting this first so it might crash the whole part Features. Mm. And we got it. So selection and I'm gonna delete everything except this body of course so this is what we need now to complete this part we have to make one top lane sketch I'm gonna spin the model like this and uh, and use this edge and this one no sorry this one and this one and this one sorry let's deselect Let's use only this edge for, for a start, so uh, offset by 5 to the left side and now offset this one and on this one <laughs> by 3 ok and somewhere around here So make sure you have this normal tool relation and distance should be somewhere around 5. Let's try extend this. Okay, so you just pull the point to go through and trim. Okay, perfect. Let's try same here. So, on left, on trim, and let's do the same on this side, so, offset by 3 to inside, pull this point and this one, and I need to make sure here that this is normal too. Yeah, it is very simple or whatever. So, mm, eyes is normal too. And power tree. Okay. So here again we need this edge converted. I think that's it. Now I'm gonna look this look at this from the front. And let's do one extra that I mean thin feature. So this should be offset by 180 and it should go up to body it's this body and this is what we don't want to get so where is thin feature select mid plane and select one and type in one millimeter as a reference so I guess that's it if you did everything 
as I did it should be fine okay next thing is the sketch on this face of the thin feature and convert everything now we can trim this and extend this edge trim again delete this one and delete this one same here okay so this is what we need to have exit sketch and let me check okay extract by 5 to down awesome and what's next okay again one sketch on top plane and I'm gonna look it from the bottom <laughs> now let's draw something like this so now make sure that no let's put fuel dimensions in 45 sure that these are vertical and these are horizontal and now it goes seven like this but opposite direction so it's somewhere around there and this line from origin goes 7.5 same for this one also now we are going to select this edge and this point make it coincident and same for this point and same process here So this is what we need to have, nothing too hard I think, exit sketch and let's see what do we have, extra it was for offsetting 195 and again up to body, it's this body, the only one we have. And make sure that the merge result is selected for all features we are working on and it's not one direction it's mid plane and the value is one millimeter so select ok and let's see what do we have Okay, just one. <laughs> of course, I made a mistake. So let's open the sketch and the sketch and select this point delete elevation. Oh, this is too much details. So select point by point and delete coincident relation. because it should be coincident with this edge I'm sorry for this mistake <coughs> so again I'm adding co coincident relation but for this edge and this point Let's 
see how it looks now. Okay, done. This is what we need to have. Now it's perfect. And one sketch on this place. So, you're gonna draw a line from this edge to this one. Make sure it's horizontal and 0 0.5 from this one in opposite direction and again same here zero point five and it's opposite direction so again, thin feature 17.5 and it's a mid plane 1 millimeter uh, thin. Thickness of the wall is 1 millimeter and that's perfect. It looks strange here, but on a real model, it really is like this so what's next okay we are just need to finish some details and we're done so let's delete this fillet i hope nothing is going to fail so if a rebuild is gonna be okay and i hope it's gonna be okay then you can continue with these details if don't you don't have to to edit this what i'm doing now it's not really important for anything it's only for the look so chamfer and the value is 4.75 angle is 45 of course and that's it <coughs> Fillet by 10 for these two edges. Okay, and fillet 0, 5 for this one and this one. And last thing is 0, 25 fillet for these two edges. So we are almost done. There is a uh, two videos left for the cable to be done and one for assembly and it's almost funny <laughs> not so easy tutorial for beginners maybe yes maybe not but i hope you will be you will find a way to finish it as i did <laughs> thanks for watching guys see ya